Hello guys, welcome back to the channel Tea Lover. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel, then please subscribe to the channel and get our latest update. So in this video, I'll talk about the recent ransomware attack and its extension is dot near. So don't get panic. We can just recover our data. So you do not have to pay any amount for that ransomware to recover your data. Okay. In this video, I'll show you how you can get your data back. So we'll just begin from the first okay so our guide begins over here the step that you should follow to recover your file is just you have to put your computer in a safe mode okay if you have got virus attack on your computer then you have to move your computer to safe mode or you can use antivirus okay follow these two steps if you have data on local disk d e f g accept c then you can just use antivirus quick kill over there okay so it will remove the ransomware virus completely so you don't have to panic over here just install the antivirus quick kill the good news is that it's one month free also if your data are located accept c drive okay so if you have data in c drive then you have to boot your computer in a safe mode if you have data in local disk d e f g then if you can then you can load on new windows in your computer so if you can then you should format your computer okay so after formatting your computer or after installing the quick kill so you just do the process till now so do the process the now if you do not want to format your computer then you have to edit something in the host so for host just move to the my computer okay this is the this this pc okay after moving to this pc you will see our local disk c over there just click for the local disk c after moving to local disk c scroll down and you can see their windows so just click on the windows after window just scroll down and you can find a system 32 over there so here is system 32 just click for it and in system 32 you have to find a driver over there search for the driver here is the drivers and you can see a asectra okay so in asectra you can find a host over there so you have to edit this host just click on the host and you have to open this with the notepad over there okay and just click on the okay so after clicking on the okay now you can see if you have attacked by a virus then just below the hashtag over here just below the hashtag over here you can see your number of ip so just select this ip and delete this ip okay so after removing that ip now we'll move for the data recovery tool okay so you should download the data recovery from the link below so i have provided the link over here just click for this download link so it is google drive links it is the fastest method so just go for the download over here and you will download this thing so it's easy to crack over here if you have confusion regarding the crack i have written the text inside its tool how to crack it so if you have any confusion to crack this tool then you can contact me through tlover2054 in instagram okay so now after completing this thing you have to scan over here okay so i'll show you how you can the scan the data so just open this stellar data recovery after installation i am just skipping this installation part if you want this installation part then i have done it in before dot extension virus videos so you can check over there so over here this is a crack version so if you haven't cracked this then you will able to see here a demo over here you will able to see a demo in the bar over here okay so you have to just remove this everything over here so do not click the everything at once okay when you select this all item and go for a scan then it will take a uh, eight hours ten hours so it will make problem for you okay so if you have a power cut then you will not able to recover your data so i always suggest you deselect this and go for one at a time so select photos at a one time select audios for one time select videos for one time okay just move like this and you can recover your data easily okay so in this video i am just recovering our data as a photos over here okay so for that i want to recover the data from a external drive so you can recover the data from external drive also just move for the photos option over here and click for the next okay 
So after clicking on the next, you should select a drive over there. Okay, from which drive you want to recover your data. So click on the that drive, and before you go for the scan, you should just click the deep scan over here. I want to tell you again, if you just do not enable this deep scan, then you will not able to recover your data over here. Okay, so just click on the deep scan over here and just go for scan. So it will take some time for it. Okay, so after doing this, you will able to recover your data. So it takes some time. Just I am skipping these parts. Okay, after completing, I will be back with you showing the recovery data from this pen drive over here. Okay. As you see that my data recovery is about to complete over here. So after being at the hundred percent over there, it will just ask you for the place where you want to recover the data. So it is hundred over here. So it has been successfully complete over here. So as you move for that, you have to just cancel this, close this dialog. Okay. So just click on the close dialog over here. So it is 4.61 GB file recovered over here. So just close and you can see that there is a raw data. So just expand the raw data and you can see the JPG over here. You can clearly see that the data has been recovered over here successfully. Okay. You have to just select a folder. So this is my bootable pen drive. So as you see that there is no data over there. So I have some images that are not related to the this bootable drive over here okay so in this way you can recover your data very easily over here now i'll show you some proof this data recovery tool will work as a hundred percent okay so i have some feedback from the instagram over here so let's go for it so as you see that you have just thanked me because you have just successfully recovered his data okay so as you see that he have just recovered the data in a pen drive over there so it is he is very thankful to me okay so just scroll down that he have also thanks me for his recovery over here these are only some example i have number of comments and reviews in my instagram regarding this data recovery data recovery so if you have any question regarding it directly contact me through the tlover2054 in instagram and thank you for watching thanks for your support so if you haven't subscribed to the channel then subscribe to the channel thank you